नमस्ते योगा इस has been known in india for many many years thousands of years um however recently which means not very recently from some time onwards there were renewed interest in yoga practice of yoga psychology of yoga philosophy of yoga and so on all over the world one of the reasons of course is the international yoga day then of course the number of yogis who have gone abroad and talked to people about yoga taught them how to practice and so on now when you say yoga it's a wide screen it's a wide subject the gita has 18 chapters each chapter is called a yoga so yoga is not confined to just physical exercises and physical practices and so on and so forth but to prove it scientifically that something actually is happening in the mind in the brain or in the physical body when you practice yoga which of course is connected to the brain we thought it would be a good idea to have some kind of uh, physical test by which you can decide now with the advent of uh, pet scan and various other scientific uh, instruments is probably possible to detect changes in the circulation changes in the breath changes in the brain waves etc that happens which yogis claim happens when you practice yoga so with this in mind since we are having an international scientific yoga convention in tavandrum in our center <clears throat> there is a yoga research center in Trivandrum. Many scientists have come together to discuss on these matters, and we also want to see if instrumentally anything can be detected in the chain pathways of the brain's functioning and so on. So a team from the IIT Delhi is coming. Other scientists are coming. So. I agreed to be a guinea pig. I don't know how it comes to, but um, they will probably put some things into my head and check the. They call it just like you have ECG in the heart. The uh, E called EEG, electroencephalograph, which is for the brain. So they are going supposed to come and check on that. Um, so that you can see if any data is available which is different from normal many such experiments have already been done a lot of buddhist lamas have tried meditating and checking their eeg and so on so they want to test it on me which is all right but i think it should be tested on others also to compare how the brain works of course and uh, hopefully it will add to the indexing of practical experiences of meditation and form some kind of a data bank which can be used in the future especially in scientific circles for whom seeing is believing so this is the conference that is going to take place all are welcome mm, and i hope there is some kind of a data base established by this we're trying it's an experiment if it works it works if it doesn't work it doesn't work but we're setting a trend so that from next time onwards it can become a proper system this is what we're going to do please don't think that the yoga is merely confined to measuring the eeg and so on it's basically a question of also the mind and how one can become better human beings on i don't think unselfishness and compassion can be measured by any instrument it's just the physical measurements that they are trying to take thank you very much and uh, namaste